In this video I will show you the basics of shape animation, also known as morphing, which in Maya is called blend shapes. First we create a cube to have something to play with. There is my cube and there it is shaded. This is my base shape. I will create a target simply by duplicating this shape, Control D, and I move it out of the way so we can see them both. Uh, I'll go into vertex mode, select a few points, and mess with them a bit just so we have a different shape. There we go. We just created a target shape. Switch back to object mode. Select the target and then shift select the original shape, the base shape. From the animation uh, menu choose create deformers blend shape. If you select the original cube in the channel box you'll see that there now is a blend shape operator and if you select the cube to input, you can see that it actually animates between the two shapes. Now if I want to add another target to this blend shape, I can simply take my original, create another duplicate by hitting Ctrl D, moving it out of the way, just so I can see it, and on this one, I'll pull on some other points. So, for instance, I'll pull up the back. And what I'll also do, I'll squeeze in the entire front, just for fun. So I'm selecting the entire front of the object, and I'm going to squeeze it in like this. And why not just also rotate it a bit? So, a totally different target shape than the first one. I'm going to go back to object mode, select the new target, and shift select the original shape, the base shape. Now I'm not going to go to create deformers but to edit deformers and add this one to the blend shape. In my channel box of the cube, under blend shape, I now have two separate targets. If I select the second target and middle mouse button drag, you can see the shape will change into the second target. And if I select the first one, it will change into the first target. If I leave the first target on one and take the second target, you can see that they can actually have both at the same time and have the second target distort the first target. And I can also create some kind of blend between the two. So these are the basics of blend shape animation in Maya.